Lark Mason, president of the board of the Appraisers Association of America, but I'm also an appraiser. Our organization has over 900 members representing every area that you could imagine in the fine and decorative works of art. And I'll show you a little bit about my gallery. This is where I work. And I have offices in New York and Texas, but I particularly love my office here in Texas. We moved this 1850s building here and restored it. And it's so appropriate because it's a wonderful old structure that was created by German um, immigrants to the United States in the 1840s and 50s. And we moved it to this location and now it functions as our office and gallery. I'm an auctioneer and I also um, do advisory work and of course I'm an appraiser. And like so many of our members, we have a variety of different skills that we use in our job. And uh, one of those for me is to have an attractive place to display these wonderful works of art but also a comfortable place to work and do research. And one of my favorite places to work and to browse through and go to for research is my library. A lot of our members, we have extensive libraries and we do research and we're knowledgeable about our areas, but we also back up our knowledge with information that we glean from a variety of sources. And our libraries are essential for this. And I just, I love going through and doing that research and that in-depth study about a variety of fields and discovering what the background of an object is, why it's important and what gives it value. And I like coming to work. I love my job and our members do also. And I like to, this time of year to thank everyone for um, all their hard work, who are members of our organization, for our many friends and people who are our clients and who rely on us for our expertise, and we rely on you too. So many thanks and come visit anytime, and not just me, but all of our members are open and all, a lot of them have a variety of different skills and jobs and opportunities to use them as a resource and go to them for advice. And we welcome those inquiries. So to all of you who are our friends and friends to be, we wish you the very best for Christmas, the new years and this holiday season and the coming year.